start to talk about the internal structure of the brain, especially the basal ganglia. Uh, when we take a medial section of the brain here exactly, this is the lamina terminalis, anterior commissure, rostrum, genio, the body, and splenium of the corpus callosum. Here, the septum pilocedum, the fornix, uh, the choroid plexus of the third ventricle, and this is the thalamus. When we take a cross section here, this is the lateral ventricle, anteriorly and posteriorly. This one is the choroid plexus of the lateral ventricle, and this is the fornix. We notice it comes from here, crossing goes medially. Taking more sections here, this is the internal structure of the brain. This is the cerebral cortex, which is a gray matter, and this is the white matter of the cerebral hemisphere. This is the area of the basal ganglia. Here, exactly, is the area for insulin. This is the cerebral cortex, is insulin. This is extreme capsule. Here is the yellow uh, color, is the rostrum. The structure is the rostrum. Okay, this is the rostrum. This one is the external capsule, and this is the internal capsule. The anterior horn or the anterior arm, posterior arm, and genu of the internal capsule. The internal and the external capsule together enclosed the lentiform nucleus, which is the uh, butamen or the globus validus laterally and the butamen medially. This one is the uh, caudate nucleus. Here, the head and the tail. The caudate nucleus together with the uh, lentiform nucleus forming the corpus striatum. Here, the anterior horn of the lateral ventricle and the posterior horn of the lateral ventricle. This is the fornix and this is the choroid plexus of the lateral ventricle. This is the choroid plexus of the third ventricle. This area is the thalamus.